Hey, how's it going? Tonight I want to try this book cover tool and I mention it or show it in my um, my latest Amazon haul, the Arts and Crafts haul from Amazon and I I got a two pack, although I'm not sure why I got a two pack. You can get this cost, the two pack cost $14.99 I think it is. I think I just checked it. Actually, I, I have the Amazon page open. <laughs> but you can also get a five pack for $29.99. They're kind of hefty. But they are a little sharp on the edges. So I had to take a file, a metal file, and kind of smooth out the edges a little bit so that they're not so risky for me. And, uh, oh, one of these, you can buy one of these. And that one is, I think, $7.99, I think. Okay, so this is the design of the book cover that I want to show you, and or I want to cover the <laughs> want to cover. That's the cover, and the cardboard. It's not really chipboard. Maybe it is. It's very thin. It's not chipboard thickness. But this comes from a variety pack of Cape Cod potato chips. And I get, this it comes as three different flavors. I get them through subscribe and save on Amazon. I get them once a month, one of these boxes. So I have so-called, or I guess it's artificial chipboard. I don't know. <laughs> it's, not as, it's not as thick. Chipboard is a little bit thicker, I think. So let's try it. This, uh, these measure four and a half by five and a half these right here this the uh, front and back cover and this measures an inch i'm also going to provide a link to a youtube creator angela um her channel name is art awry and she tried out the the book book cover tool book binding i you know <laughs> what's this thing called Okay, let's see. It's called Book Cover Guide. There you go. Stainless steel, oh, five and one, stainless steel metal book binding cover tool for making book cover, creating book covers out of chipboard, simple, adding personal touch to a notebook or album. That's almost the entire title. Man, these titles are too long. <laughs> okay. So let's try it. Let's try it. I'm going to use this whole sheet. No, no. <laughs> I'm just, I'm not going to cut it back yet. And so that's the idea. The idea is to, let's see if I can remember. Also, there's a video on that web page, the description page, where that you can, uh, oh, I need glue. Ah, I need glue. <laughs> I was so excited about coming on here that I forgot to get the glue. Where's my glue? One moment. One, oh, you know, I can use my my glue stick. Okay, Scotch Create glue stick. These are priceless now, right now, because they don't, uh, Scotch people don't sell these sticks anymore. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, what was I going to say? I got all discombobulated here. Oh, I want to move this up a little. Let me move this up a little. This is a 12 by 12 sheet. And somewhere down the road, there will be another arts and crafts haul from Amazon on paper products, office products. And this paper will be included. This came in a, a package of, I think, 24 sheets, two sheets per so 12 designs okay let's see i want to i want to measure i want to measure believe it or not wow <laughs> position it on the board here i just don't use i have this mat that has these one inch markings half inch markings and yet i do not use these measurements which is really weird <laughs> Don't you find that weird? I find that weird. And also, most crafters don't really use the measurements on their cutting mat. We use these mats for everything under the sun. Do we use it to measure? Mm -mm. Nope. 
Okay. Oh, I'm going to move that up just a little there. Okay. So, I want... No, I want it back. <laughs> I can't make up my mind. I want... Maybe an inch... Pencil. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is a comedy of errors today. Oh, I can do it like that. Wait, isn't that what Angela did? Yeah. <laughs> I should have rewatched that video. That would be about an inch. And you know, this part up, up here is for like rounding off the corners here. But you can do that here, I noticed. Right here. Because it kind of is curvy there. It's not a straight edge. Okay, I want to bring it over. I just want to bring it over just a little. I don't think this measures an inch. This is three quarters of an inch wide here. Okay, okay, now we're talking. Don't you love it when somebody comes in here and doesn't know what she's doing? <laughs> I love it. Okay, I am going to... I'm just going to do this. And this... Okay, that's where I want to... <laughs> that's where I want to glue it. Oh my gosh, all that time it took. I'm not even going to tell you. I'm imagining things. I, I keep thinking I'm seeing hairs. Okay, I'm putting this down. Am I doing it wrong? Probably. Also, this design has a brick wall. I didn't even notice that until right before I started, turned on the camera. Okay. Not that it matters, but the cardboard is right side up. Oh, yeah. Okay. Ooh, God, I did it! <laughs> For a minute there, I thought I saw a pencil line down there. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, then... This one. Now, am I going to have room over here, Tammy? No. Yes. Oh, that's interesting. Now this, how did I get this? How? Did, <laughs> how? Okay, so this part here, this little stem, is for positioning the spine away from the cover. Be careful, Tammy. <laughs> Even though I filed this sharp tool down, it's still a little sharp. Oh, is that is that wrong? This doesn't look like it's level. We're not going to worry about that right now, are we? We are not. Okay, I'm going to do this again. Roughly. Oh, I should use the the glue pen. Didn't I show the glue pen, the Scotch Create glue pen? I cannot tell. <laughs> I can't because on clear glue on white <laughs> on a white surface. Oh no, not that one. <laughs> oh wait, do we want to make sure that's my favorite 
flavor of chips by Cape Cod, by the way. The, I love it. I wish it was a box of 21 or 20. I think it's a box of 20. 20 sea salt and vinegar. And of course, you know, we should, we should measure this. Measure this, Tammy. <laughs> All right. Okay, now I am going to, since it says, uh, what is this? This is not an inch, as you can tell, because you can see the black down there, the black mat. So I'm just going to do it like this. And now it's a six in one. I can feel that glue. <laughs> I can feel the glue. Just go right to the end. Is that underneath? Yes, it is. Ah. <laughs> That's frustrating. Like, why is it so hard? Did I really? Yes. <laughs> okay, also, back here, you probably can't see it. I'm probably too far out. Yeah, out of range there. Okay. Then I am going to. No, I don't think I should take a chance on that. I think I'm gonna go with cutting the paper with scissors. <laughs> cutting off that paper. Oh right, it'll have part of the brick on the design. Now, now what do I do? Try and remember. Oh, uh, this, right? This. Let's say we'll do it like. No, we can't do it like that either. I probably don't need this for that either. This is to kind of miter the. That is so weird that it doesn't come to the edge like that. Angela was right. <laughs> but I'm going to do it anyway, just like that. And then cut it my own special way. Kind of a weird thing. If you're not used to doing this, it's not your thing. It's going to be kind of awkward like it is for me right now. <laughs> Just a little bit awkward. Okay, and see, I'm, I'm off there. How am I off? <laughs> like, what is that? Like, what is it? Just a minute. It's driving me crazy. Maybe that's from the guide or no. <laughs> that can't be from the guide. Okay. 
See, I always cut it like that and don't leave any... Let me cut that off. Hi, Coconut. Coconut says hi in her own special way. I just have to see it, you know. Okay, I'm going to try it the way the, the video on Amazon... That is going to be off. I'm going to do it like this. I'm going to cut it very close to the corner. I'll probably regret it, <laughs> but that's okay. And I always do it the same way, too, that Angela does it to bend it up like that. That's almost like scoring it with the cardboard. Okay, let's see. If I do that... <laughs> it a little... <clears throat> okay. Now I could, I suppose I could cover it, you know. No. Well, I could cover it with this on the inside because this is going to Hmm. It's going to kind of cover it, right? Oh, we will see. Maybe I'll do it that way. Oh. That might be better. If I do it like that, though. What did I say? That was four and a half. Four and a half. I can't count unless this is one down here or something. <laughs> or zero. One, two, three, four. Oh, yeah. I'm going to do four. Four and a half. I've taken too long. I already know. And this end You thought I was gonna mess up, didn't you? <laughs> yes, that's how my thinking's been lately. Okay. Just a minute. Long scissors. Now this one I'm not too particular about cutting it too straight. Like I'm okay if I go a smidge off kilter. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I want it for this part right here. Five and a half. I want to see. I want to see. Okay. Also, wait. I thought I was doing it this way. <laughs> Ooh! I want the brick wall, the brick wall on the front, or this on the front brick wall on the back. Oh my gosh, I can't make up my mind. Actually, I don't think it matters, right? So, all the more reason to get with the program, Tammy.
Okay, so we're going to try this. I'm not going to cover this. Because I think I can put signatures in from it. <laughs> I'll figure something out. So I don't want to cover it right now. I want to leave it as is. Just like that. All gluey and everything. Okay. Now... the way I wanted it to. Ooh, pretty pretty. Wait, we're not done yet. It's not pretty pretty yet. be done apparently <laughs> it can't be done perfectly that's okay nobody's perfect Should have done it the way I was used to doing it. Hmm. Okay, this is kind of a cool design for a book cover. And you know, I'm thinking this isn't too bad considering this is my first time ever doing this. When I'll link you, I'll put a link to Angela's video doing this, and she'll show you the finished product before she shows you how to make it. I like to do the, uh, I like to do it the other way. <laughs> Even though it does kind of upset at least one person I know. Sorry, Dolly. <laughs> Perhaps. Now, what do you think went wrong there? Okay, so this also has a... It's not too bad, actually. I like it. It's nice and thin there. I'm sorry, I went off track. This also has a hole. As you can see, a hole here. And, and like I said, it also has this part that you can, you can cut. Actually, I think I'm going to keep it as a sharp edge here. Maybe that's maybe that's what it was. I don't know. But I'm not going to round that off or anything. I'll keep it just like that. And if it pokes me, then I'll cut it back. <laughs> but this also has this. This little hole here. And you can put like a little hole. If I decide that this is the front. Right then I can put a little hole here and a little hole here and put like a little uh, band over it you know like a little little thing like a almost like a rubber band only like an elastic band over it but I don't know if I want to do that either maybe I'll just do this I like it how long did I spend on this less than 40 minutes Wow, it'll be, it should be hopefully a lot less than 40 minutes for you, my lovely viewers. Oh, this part, this part is supposed to be, what is it here? So you can bend it. Maybe it's like this. Hello. <laughs> Hello, do the whole thing. This, I want this to be longer, you know, I want this to be longer, 
and this end to be longer or at least so that I can pull it out an extendable one an extendable book guide get on it manufacturers <laughs> thank you in advance I would do this Oh, I think it's cool. Hmm. Which one looks better? That way? Or that way? I'm thinking this way. I like that it's a brick wall. That's wild. I'll put a link to these papers for you. Do Would you like me to put a link for the Cape Cod potato chips too? Okay, I'll do that too. <laughs> Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and have a creative day. Bye.